Well, we have with us uh, the Naya Ladka, according to Salman Khan, who is uh, giving a tough competition to almost uh, the biggest of stars. And many would say that um, he is an alternate industry in his own way and he is ushering in uh, the new age of cinema. Uh, huge pleasure to have you back on Bollywood Rangama Ranbir. Thank you so much, Faridun. Always uh, happy to chat with you. Fantastic. Now, uh, how do you react when, when Salman Khan, uh, and I think in all good earnest, he said that uh, uh, the Naya Ladka and he, he's, he's, he's just uh, doing wonders right now. It's great. Uh, you know, when, a, when such a superstar like Salman Khan I mean, uses your name, you know, you, this, it's very encouraging, uh, and especially the way he said it. Uh, because I think he's reached a place in his life that he's not insecure about anything, and rightly so. Uh, and when he speaks like this about somebody who's just beginning in his, in his career, uh, it's very encouraging. You feel great, and you feel like, are yaar, kuch to sahi jara hoga that you know Salman Khan is using your name in, in such a way. There is one one question that I, I think almost every interview you must be asked uh, that uh, you had those two dialogues in the promo about uh, DDLJ song and uh, the chulbul and dabang and ki kahin na kahin Salman or Shah Rukh ke upar aapne nishana sa raha hai. Do you have the uh, the entire answer for that? Like absolutely really in your, in your think, mind I because you must be saying it again and again. I think it's 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 also fueled by the media mm -hmm. because I'm I'm a very secure and an arrogant actor. Yeah. I don't believe in making fun of other actors to succeed in life. Yeah. So when I am in uh, the field of like a Sarso Ka Khet and I am uh, urinating there, it's not that I'm making fun of Shah Rukh Khan because whenever you see Sarso Ka Khet, Dilwale Dulhaniya Le Jayenge is such an iconic song that you only get reminded of that. I don't think I'm making fun of Shah Rukh Khan when I'm doing that. When I'm saying a dialogue like Sirf Chulbul Naam Rakhne Se Dabang Nhi Ban Jata, I'm telling my father that because his name is Chulbul uh, Chautala, my mom's name is Bulbul Chautala, the characters in the film. So when you see it in the context of the film, you probably realize that it's not really making fun of anybody. It's they're all comedy situations. It's just for a good laugh. It's for good humor. So that is my belief. But I do believe that a lot of people felt okay, that we were, uh, especially their fans. Yeah, it and, is true. And I would like to apologize to them because that wasn't our intention. You know, right. Our intention is not to make fun of stars that we grew up on. You know, superstars right. that that have influenced and inspired me. Now the fact is, six years and the sort of success that you've seen, especially after starting off with Savadia, which was not a box office success. And I still remember before um, Wake Up Sid when we had met and uh, how things were for you and how Wake Up Sid was an important film for you as well in terms of box office success as well. Now uh, when the su sort of success that you are seeing right now, you have a lot of people within the industry who tend to be, who chane ke jhaar pe chalana is a very very I think uh, favorite pastime of a lot of people as well. How do you maintain that equilibrium and just, just stay grounded all the time? Well I am not trying to stay grounded or maintain an equilibrium. Uh, mm -hmm. A, I don't understand you as a superstar. Mm -hmm. I feel that the word that superstar is easy to give to someone if someone's film hits. If I'm a superstar, then Teen Khan is what is it? That's God. You know, so you can't give me the term superstar. I have just had a hit film, you know, which my last film was a, was a hit film. So I have to repeatedly do that over a large period of time. Uh, you know, I have to contribute something uh, to the society. I have not done anything of that sort. Okay. So I'm starting out. So I don't take these tags too seriously. B, I'm not trying to be modest or I'm not trying to be humble. Uh, this is the way I am. This is how I've been brought up. Uh, I have a good reality check. I'm surrounded with very few people in my life because I'm not a people person. I'm a little shy. So I try and just uh, focus all my brain cells towards the few people that I've known over a period of time. And it's basically that. I'm, I'm arrogant. Uh, where my talent is concerned mm. uh, and that is it. I have a lot of self-confidence as in I have self-belief that I have it to, to, to become big in life. Right. You know, I have, that's, that's the only thing going for me is my mm. self-belief and the confidence I have so I can put in my work. I'm very happy, I'm very grateful for the fact that I get to do what I love. Mm. You know, I don't take it for granted even though people say I'm a star son, mm. I know that they give me such tags and I have to fight that shadow constantly mm. because I'm trying to make an in individual identity of myself. I want people to recognize me for my work, not because mm. Are Yathuri Chiko Raj Kapoor's son, Raj Kapoor's son. Apparently, Sanjay Gonzalez did not know that you are Raj Kapoor's son. Of course, he knew that. Of course, see, see, when you're when you're a star son, of course, I went with my resume. You know, I didn't make my father call him and all. But he obviously knew that. But when you're a celebrity kid, your first film आसानी से मिल जाती है. Your first opportunity. But the sustaining it, you know, to to make an identity of your own, to come out of the shadow of your father and your forefathers, that's the hard part. And I'm constantly fighting that. You know, I'm here to make a name of myself. If I'm producing a movie, जगह जासूस, I don't want to do it under the R K film banner because I feel कि I'm taking the help and support of a already established banner by my grandfather. You know, I have to start something on my own. I have to make my own identity mm -hmm. so that when my children are acting in movies, they are not under my grandfather's shadow, my father's shadow and my shadow. You know, they should also create something on their own and make their own identity. So that's the endeavor. You know, I'm, I don't take acting too seriously. I'm not saving the world. I'm only acting in films. I'm entertaining an audience. And that's pretty much it.